Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and in Claremont Colleges, we have people, students of color, who are refusing to room with whites. I'm going to find out what Claremont College is. Here's a Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh College, which is part of this. Uh, they're in California, where else? I guess I should have just figured. Anyway, go back to the main story. All right, uh, you have students of color refusing to room with whites. Now, you reverse this situation. It's called bigotry, racism, and so forth. But because they're, they are of color, it's called diversity or something. I'm not sure what. Group of students at Claremont Colleges in search of a roommate insists that the roommate not be white. Student Carrie Urena posted on his face, Facebook that non white students in need of housing arrangements should reach out to either her or two other students with whom she plans to live in an off campus house. The post states that. POC, people of color only, will be considered for this living arrangement. I don't want to live with any white folks, Irina added. Uh, Carrie, Irina, you are a bigot. Plain simply, you are a racist bigot. And then you turn around and uh, say what threats whites are. This is disgusting. Delia Zada expressed concerns to anti-white discrimination. POC, maybe, only, maybe I'm missing something or misunderstanding your post, but how is it that that is not a racist thing to say? Correct, Dahlia. This is directed to protect POC, not white people. Don't see how this is racist at all, responded A.J. Leon, Leon, a member of the Pittsburgh Lat Latino Student Union. Yeah, because you too are racist and bigot. You're bigoted against whites. People of color are allowed to create safe POC-only spaces, which they shouldn't be able to do. It is not reverse racism or discriminatory, it is self-preservation. Sarah Rashidi, another Pitts, Pitzer Latino student um, union member, said, Reverse racism isn't a thing. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Of course, it, of course it's reverse racism. Well, it's not reverse racism. It's just plain racism. You're of the same mindset as these idiots in the Ku Klux Klan, Sarah Rushdie, Rushdie, however you pronounce it. A lot of weird names in this story. You are the exact same mindset as people in the Ku Klux Klan. You're just as much of a bigot as a grand wizard. I don't want to have to tiptoe around fragile white feelings in a space where we can just come to relax and be comfortable, commented Nina Lee, a women's studies major. I could live with white people, but I would be far more comfortable living with other POC. That was not so bad, at least so she could live with it. White people always... Man, because they don't feel included at the end of the day, y'all are damaging ASF, and the POC pr feels they need to protect themselves from that toxic environment, they can. Quick to try to jump on a POC, but you won't call your friends out when they're being racist, ASF. Noted Tariana Smith, an African... Africana Studies major and resident assistant RA for 2016-2017 year.
I'm not responding, no comments, and nope, I don't want to have a dialogue. And I, and I call, here's another one. Now, these are all whack jobs, you have to understand this. Another RA and whack student union member, Jessica St. Fleur. I don't know what these designations are, PZ... 18. I think it's that one college that I showed you, and then it was class 18. That's what it got, has to be mean. Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh College, and then class eight, 18. Jessica St. Fleur added the thread of comments white people have cause sick so much mf trauma on these campuses why in the world would i want to live with that bring that into my home a place is supposed to be safe for me well uh i have news for you a whole bunch of you you got some serious mental issues yeah yeah some serious mental issues i mean <sighs> What would happen if the college found out that there was a group of clan members who wouldn't want uh, to live with anybody of color? Hell would, all hell would break loose. But these ones can get away with this? I'm sorry, they should be disciplined at some, somehow, I'm not sure how. Well, I should be told, unless you can find your own roommate, we're going to stick you with anybody we want. And it won't necessarily be a person of color. Could be white, could be anybody else. I work with people of color, so, you know, I just have to live with it. This is ridiculous and absurd. This is ridiculous, absurd, and stupid. And these uh, students need to have their need to be slapped alongside the head or something. I don't know. Unbelievable. Yes. So I'm saying the colleges need to land on their heads a little bit and tell them, "Hey, you don't get it." You don't get to make choice unless you're paying for, if you pay for your uh, residence off campus and you, you can choose who you want to live with, fine. But it shows that this is just plain bigotry on part of these Latino and black students. I'm gonna call it like it is. Their mentality is the same as a Ku Klux Klan member. I'm not taking it back. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.